Hey guys, Zuljin here, and welcome back to another episode of Monster Sanctuary. We're at the intersection that we kind of started out at. Right? Keeper Stronghold. That's where we're headed to right now. Keeper Stronghold. And, uh, of course, something's in our way. Okay, we gotta use Potato today, man. Uh, choose monsters. Let's go ahead and choose Potato and bring him in, uh, in the place of... Let's bring him in the place of Hana Bear. For now, okay? Uh, so let's see. We've got Punch Combo, Leaf Slash, Spores. Spores give a magical weakness debuff. We can do that. Let's do it to this guy. All right, weak now, perfect. Okay, put a beating on him. And uh, Squishy, what are you gonna do, man? <laughs> <laughs> there we go. We could have probably killed that cat in the middle, but. It's a, it's a new style of deal. We'll be able to kill two of them this time. Dang! Squishy got a healing, buddy. Okay, let's heal. And uh, I'm pretty sure that restore is kind of the same thing. Yeah, heals. Cool. So I can... Actually, I think we're going to do some leaf slashing here. Yeah, I, I want to get through. Punch combo. Potato is really weak, man. Potato, <laughs> potato is really weak. Let's finish him off with with that. We should have just did the sidekick buff like we were. For, a party, uh, for, an, uh, for three enemies, it would have been plenty worth it, man. Plenty. Or potato could have been healing. Which we'll, he'll need to do now. <laughs> Big time. Just in case. All right, beating. And let's go ahead and do a slime shot. So they have an earth weakness. So Potato had an earth attack, was it? Let's see, which, which attack was the earth-based attack that Potato had? Leaf Slash. All right, not bad, not bad. Still could have been a little bit better though, but he's he's not high level. The good thing is he gets XP no matter what. Like you'll see Hana Bear gains experience here. See that? Hana Bear still gains experience, so we can fight until Potato is a little bit more viable. Also, Potato, I don't think we gave him anything at all, man. Uh let's see. Apples. We can he's already had two, actually. Berries do plus 25 health and mana. I think we'll just have to give him some better equipment, maybe. Okay, so right now, yeah, all he has is a wooden stick. So we could give him a feather, a tome. Oh, the tome's pretty good. We can give him a shell. And what does the ribbon do? That is uh, health and mana. Or crit chance and mana regen. Let's go ahead and do that. And do we have another weapon that we can give to him? Yeah, we have the kunai. All right, he's going to be much more viable now. Much more viable. Okay, we're at the Keeper Stronghold. Welcome to the Keeper Stronghold, home to all monster keepers. Thanks. Oh. <laughs> double double. <laughs> what? <laughs> Here in the Keeper Stronghold, monsters live alongside humans. We raise them to be our friends. A monster raised by a human would never attack a human. Well, that's good to know. Usually, champion monsters are very rare, but recently, we've been... We've been seen in they've been seen in all regions of the sanctuary okay I kind of want to just go forward here and see what's going on bye oh hell yeah what does the wand do okay 40 defense 15 we got mana regeneration and claws this looks pretty good is that is there any crit chance yeah shurikens damage magic and crit chance I like that a lot Defense 15, crit 7. Okay, I think Shuriken we're going to buy. Okay, and hear me out here. Let's look at equipment. Hana Bear is already kind of crit focused. Crit damage is 150, crit chance is 15. Versus uh, crit damage 164. Oh, crit damage 13, actually. So we might, we might take some of these off here. Let's see, Vital Ring, crit damage. Let's go Feather. 
Okay. Oh, no. Bandana is... Yes. Okay. Now, Hana Bear is going to take the bracelet and change it out for the impact ring. We're going to take the shell and switch it out for the feather. And we're going to take the crit ring. Well, we already got the crit ring. And the Cestus is actually going to be switched out for the shuriken. And now we have some sort of a crit build, which seems pretty good. Piaggiato, on the other hand, right now is doing a lot of attack damage, but no magic. I think Potato has that combo or whatever. We're going to go ahead and give him the Cestus. So Pidgeot now can use the Kunai. And now Potato will be able to use... There we go, the Morning Star. I think that's... I guess that's an okay trade-off. I don't know if the Morning Star is that good for anything that we have specifically right now. Honestly. Okay. Yeah, we'll try this setup right here. Anything else that I can get that I'd want to? Shell, claws. We could probably use another shell. Vital rings are nice too. Feathers, mana regen, belts. Let's go ahead and use one more shell. Okay, and right here, equipment. Hmm. I needed it for somebody, right? I thought I did at least. Dang it! No, I didn't. Well, I'll use them on my next one. Okay, we can buy items with this. The skill reset is only 250 gold. That's not bad. We'll be able to use that when we try stuff out. We can probably buy just a Phoenix tier since we already used one. Everything else we have full. Potatoes, walnuts, berries, and... Okay. Ooh. Crit damage plus four. Berry. I already have one berry already. So, let's see. Inventory, berry, Hana bear. So now he's got berry damage. Now the only thing that he doesn't have is health. Let's just let's just put him full crit. Except for that one. Now he has two crit fruit that he ate, the berries or whatever. We'll see how that goes. Hey rookie, got your first monsters? Be careful, a lot stronger strong a lot of strong champion monsters were spotted recently. Okay, I'll keep that in mind. The cause of all this hubbub is unclear, but I'm determined to get to the bottom of it. Alright, we still haven't gone up at any of these locations yet. I'm just kind of trying to follow a single route. The exit leads to the blue cave. Other keepers reported they spotted some champion monsters down there. Hello, fellow spectral keeper. Do you hear the rumors? They say there's an unusual amount of champion monsters around. Mysterious, isn't it? Wouldn't it be awesome if we managed to hunt one down? That would grant us quite some respect in the keep. Perhaps I might be able to discern the cause of the rise of the champion monsters. Might be an unnatural phenomenon. I hatched my first monsters only recently, though I studied monsters and stuff for some years, but I have I still have some troubles. So I think we should support each other. The two of the two other spectral keepers have an advantage on us. Leonard is a bit older, so he already gathered some experience. Julia started as a monster keeper at a very young age, so she has more experience than us as well. Hey, what are you doing in here? It's dangerous in the blue caves. Don't you have any grasp of what's going on? I'm going after those champion monsters. That's not the right task for someone. some greenhorns. We will see. Oh boy. Fool! <laughs> you fool. So this seems like it might be a tougher area based on what we got. Oh my goodness. Um, are we ready for this, guys? Not save and quit. Huh. Let's do it. Let's do it. Level sevens. Um, okay, let's go in with our, our big squad here. Start combat. Okay, and let's check the enemy info. We got water weakness, fire weakness, water weakness. Okay, so it will be ice going in. Um, let's start out with a sidekick buff. And, oh, we got a random extra buff. That's nice. And we'll do slime shot two, acid rain. Acid Rain looks like it affects these guys pretty good because it's a water, okay? So we'll start with the first guy here. Very nice. And armor break. Okay. So, 
They've got a water weakness, huh? Ice hail. Ooh, baby. That was a level two restore. Flame strike level two. Ooh. They have an AOE, bruh. Dang. <laughs> All right. Um, as much as I really think I should heal here. Ice will kill him for sure, so I'm not even worried about that. Ice will get him there. Okay, I think I'm gonna do beating on this guy. Nice. And Ice Hail. Beautiful. Okay. Slime shot. Oh, you can't do that to Squishy, man. Cool. Ooh, but we got that healing, that regen buff. Okay, nice. Um, this guy's fire weakness. We can acid rain him. We can arcane shot. Or we could. Let's just do a heal really quick, just to make sure Pidgeot stays okay. All right, and. Uh, I think Ice will just kill this guy in one shot here. No, it won't. So... I think I'm gonna have to do beating and ice. It might have got him, but that would have been rough. It would have been kind of rough there. Okay, we got this. No problem. This is a dang hard fight compared to what we've been doing, though. Compared to what we've been doing, it's pretty good. Ah, uh, yeah, you keep hitting Squish. He's just regening like crazy. Uh -huh. Um, <laughs> there we go. Slime shot, man. All right, and uh, beating, and I think claws. Oh, it was a fire weakness, huh? I think spectral fire would have probably did better. Let's try this time. Spectral Fire, or Spectral Flame, I should say, Arcane Bolt. Very nice. Very nice. Okay, three stars out of that, and we got a Walnut and Cotton. Oh, gosh, and everybody leveled up. That's what we needed, man. Okay, we really needed that. Okay, we're level seven. Yeah, we're right around the, the right level for this stuff. Uh, Acid Rain 2, Health Plus, Arcane Bolt 2, Combo Healing, Heals Skill, Trigger an Additional Heal for 30% Magic Value, wow. Improves Magic Rating by 1. Yeah, let's do that. Okay, Hana Bear. Hana Bear can learn the Crit Plus. We already said that we're really going to focus on Crit for him. And Potato, what is Potato doing? Potato is on... Potato's gonna be on that restoration tip. I think he can, he'll can he be able to squishy, uh, intercha interchange with Squishy. Okay, this door, probably gonna be blue cave key required. We haven't found any keys whatsoever yet, so... Ooh, a little fall there. Nope. Didn't think so, but I had to try. Obtain blue cave key. Well, we found it. Are we gonna be able to get... No, that's a little bit different, huh? Yeah. I was about to say, will we be able to go around the right way? But I don't think so. Maybe we'll come back around that way. Who knows? Okay, we're through. Okay, now there's two healers. So we should probably still take down, we should probably focus on the guy in the back. Okay, so Acid Rain, because he's got a water weakness. Okay, Beating. I don't think he'll, I'll still kill him. I think I'm gonna have to sidekick. 
Tell you what, I'm gonna split my damage up because I if they both heal, that's fine. But Yeah, if they both heal, that's fine. But I don't want them to totally negate all of my progress on one thing. There we go. Slime shot is perfect there. Acid rain level three? Dude. All right, that's pretty rough. Um, I think we need... I think we need a heal. <laughs> as much as I don't want to. <laughs> All right, beating level two. There we go. And ice hail. This may kill him. Yes! Them crits! Them crits, man. Poison's not cool. Alright, at least they didn't poison all three of us. Okay, let's just take one out here. I think I'm gonna do slime shot two. Okay, and let's do beating. And we'll do the flames. So close, man. Ooh, the poison got him. Perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Yeah, the poison's getting us too, though. Six hits. Beautiful. All right, 160% damage here. It's not bad at all. And 87 from the poison. Yeah, we got this guy in the bag, man. Arcane Bolt. And just Spectral Flame will finish him. Nice. Bunch of crits there. Still only a... Uh, <laughs> Still only three stars, though. Okay. Skills. All right. I think we need to give you a little bit more damage here. Leaf Slash. Okay. Um, Pidgeot. Pidgeot, we're going to give... Let's give you a new ability. Featherstorm. Okay. Okay. What is this? Oh. I see. So, basically what we're going to have to do, we're we're raising those platforms that were below us, I think. Is that what we were doing here? We, we might be able to lower again. Oh no, we're there. Did we just get that right the first time? Ha <laughs> ha! Very nice. Obtain bracelet. Okay. Um, but this one needs to be higher now and that one needs to be higher. So we need to bring the middle one up and the last one up. But I was lucky. <laughs> up. Up. And now we should just be able to get right across. Glad there's no fall damage in this game. Eek! So close. So do we need to go up again with both of them one time? One time each. Up, up, and away. That will set us free. The blue caves, man. Up. And up. And I think that's the closest I'll be able to get. Because if this one was any higher, I couldn't reach it. There we go. Yeah, not too bad, not too bad. Neat little puzzle. 
what do we have here? A little chest. Don't mind if I do. Obtain the ribbon. Ooh, three of these guys. Yeah, let's do it. Let's do it. All right, there's a chest behind him too. I like that. All right, acid rain. Oh, what I should have did is uh, sidekick, man. Dang it. I always forget. And I got a random uh, buff from that. Cool. Okay, this first round is going to hurt a lot, I think. The flame strikes are actually... It's more damage, but... It's less to worry about when they fireball. Um... Okay, let's do Acid Rain. Kind of get them prepped, right? Let's do Beating on this guy. And Ice Hail will finish this first guy. Dang. All right. I think we're going to need a heal here. As much as I don't want to. Beating. Yeah, beating will almost finish that, that uh, middle guy, but I know ice will for sure. There we go. Hana Bear hits hard, man. Hard. A lot harder than Squishy. <laughs> Listen, man. <laughs> it's not my fault you hit like a girl. Okay. Uh, beating. And ice. Wonderful. Victory. Walnuts. Walnuts. A Kator. Hmm. Kator brings up attack and crit chance. Brings down magic significantly, though. I don't know if I like that. We use quite a bit of magic with both of them, to tell you the truth. Actually, the kunai is kind of rough for Pidgeot, too. I think they're both kind of rough. At least this one gives them some defense. Cestus and the Ktar. Yeah, I think I think we're good without actually equipping the Ktar. And we can't get up there. So we can't move high enough. Okay. Ooh, mushrooms. New fungi. They are weak to fire. All of them are weak to fire. I don't really have anything that does a whole bunch of fire damage, man. Um... Spectral Flame is neutral. I thought for some reason it was fire, but it's not. Um, 2 times 130, 3 times 70, so 210, 260. I think Claws are his most powerful attack. That's neutral. So let's go ahead and sidekick. Okay. And let's, uh, let's Slime Shot him. And we'll use claws. They got beating two as well. Beating three. Acid rain. Okay. We got a, a passive region buff from um, from Pidgeot buffing them. Let's see. Slime shot on this guy. The poison starts affecting him. Beating two will kill this guy. The, well, the poison will if it doesn't. And we can use claws on this guy. Ooh, that was a good hit. That ain't gonna save you, partner. Not gonna save you. So the mushrooms ain't nothing. They just beat. They just beating, man. 
Let's, uh, let's slime shot this guy. We just play it safe. Oh, he wasn't poisoned. He broke the poison. Dang it! He got a free attack on us, but he's chilled now, whatever that does. That was spores and weakness. Okay. Arcane Bolt will finish this guy. Okay. And close. Not quite dead, but very close to it. Still a very easy battle. Nice job, Squishy. Three stars. Ooh! Fungi egg! Okay, inventory. I'm sorry. Uh, skills. Hana Bear. What are we doing here? What are we doing? What are we doing? I think... I think we learn Ice Bolt level 2 here. Okay, level 8. Squishy, you are gonna learn... Acid Rain level 2. And we're gonna... Use our Fungi Egg. Hatch the Fungi! Oh gosh, what do we name <laughs> <laughs> what do we name this guy? I don't think we've ever had any mushrooms that we liked. Um, how about... How about Bella? Because <laughs> I love baby Bella mushrooms. Bella. Okay, and we can give Bella some defense to start with. Okay, I like that. Apple would give him... Uh, health? Oh, no, mana. Yeah, we'll save on the apples right now. Uh, let's see. Skills. You have only three. Okay, you have beating. You have spores. Okay, maybe we should work on your spores. And this is what? Poison bomb. Oh, I like that. Multi-poison. Multi-poison. Poison debuff can be stacked up to three times. <whistles> That's where it's at. Every hit has a chance to apply poison? <laughs> What? Magic plus improves magic rating by one. This is crazy, dude. Proliferate when applying a debuff, trigger an additional 30% damage hit. I like that a lot. Let's let's improve health. This guy's pretty cool, man. This guy's pretty cool, and we still have a point to use. Uh let's go ahead and use Spores level two, you think? Or I think we're just gonna go with the poison build right now. I think that's the what we're gonna do. Nice, man. Very nice. Okay. What else we got down here? Hmm. No way of me. No, I didn't think so. That little ledge to the right. Couldn't get to it. Okay, I can go left or right here. There's a chest. Pretty good. A red gym. It's an upgrade material. We still haven't seen that. Probably some stuff that we can do inside. Ooh, Cestus plus one. Uh, probably something we can do inside the um, the deal. Cestus plus one brings everything up except for crit chance. Kunai. Cestus plus one. I think we're going to go with this. Yeah, that looks good. And the orb works pretty good here. I do think... Yeah. I like the way all this looks. Bella can use some stuff now. Bella has the uh the poison attacks. So let's do Kunai. Let's do a ribbon, a bracelet, and a shell. Beautiful. Okay. Looks good. And we fought these guys before. We're going to try them a little bit differently, though. Uh, let's choose monsters. And let's choose Pidgeot, 
Bella and Hana. Okay, Pidgeot is going to sidekick. Poison Bomb. They got fire weaknesses, but I don't have anything that casts fire here. Water weakness, we already know that uh, ice, what ice is going to do to this guy. Let's go ahead and poison bomb. Okay, poison, good. And ice hail. So I wonder if they're poison... They got three poison debuffs, he said. They can stack, right? Oh my goodness. Okay, we don't have a healer. <laughs> I just thought about that. Um, Featherstorm will kill this guy, so will Beating. Let's just do it. Okay, we're going to heal a little bit from the regen. So I'm not super worried about that. Spore is going to... What does Spore do? Applies weakness debuff. We'll try that. And it actually poisons anyway. Oh gosh. Um, and Ice Hail is not what we're looking for. Let's just do Claws here. We healed a little bit from that. Spore. Mist. Weakness. There's the Poison Bomb. Okay. That was not what I wanted to do. <laughs> that was not what I wanted to do at all. Dude. That was good stuff right there. Maybe the mite was a good uh good thing. But they really have to Hana Bear. Really after him. Let's do a beating. Let's do poison bomb. And let's do claws. The poison will kill him. Perfect! Kinda. <laughs> Still only three stars though. We're not exactly just knocking him down. Couple of skill ups here. Pidgeot can go up to level two of the deal. Potato is going to grab... I like the spore level two thing. But I think his passives are very important as well. What is this? Improved mana regeneration. Let's give him some life. Let's give him some health. Uh, oh. Stand back and watch how a real keeper manages a wild monster. You just... All you did is kill a slime. Another gl glorious victory. Ha ha. <laughs> well, she could go on with a bad self, man. She could go on. We're going to continue the next time, guys. I hope you all enjoyed this episode. If you did, give us a dap on that like button to show you support. And you can subscribe to the channel for more daily videos. Thanks so much for watching. As always, this is Uljin signing off. And we'll see you next time.